What happened here? Huh. Was wondering when you'd show up. Jesus, what a mess. Was in the neighborhood. Thought I'd stop by. Truth be told, you and your partner left quite an impression. I was actually hoping to ask you and him a few questions. But as you can see, he isn't exactly here right now. In fact, the entire town seems deserted. By the state of the place, I'd say there was some kind of struggle here. I think someone's taken your partner. Who kidnapped him? What makes you think I'd know? Why don't you search around or something? Maybe you can find the answer to who did this. Busted. Damn. Stains. Mm. Broken. What have we here? Fine. Holiday. I don't suppose you've got a holotape player. I see him! Suppressive fire! Avoid the tag! Oh, shit! Slick! Forget the beacon! I need you to get back here! Fast! Damn it! Just go! Away! Shit! Shepard's down! He's toast! Not wants him alive. Just bind his hands and get the bag over his head. Hey. Hey, kid. It's safe to come in now. Oh, uh, okay. Wait, who is that? You've heard him. Never mind who it is. Just get ready to start moving the tech. But first, check out that terminal. Find out why it's flashing like that. Um, it looks like there's a message being recorded. It's not transmitted yet. I think I could stop it broadcasting. I just need to... Uh, I can make sure it don't broadcast. Move, egghead. Wh what are you... Wait, don't! Yeah? Who kidnapped him? Mm. Whoever it was, they've got your partner. Sounded like he gave back as good as he got, though. Maybe he's got more backbone than I thought. Hey, check out the remains of the attacker your partner took down. Don't be shy. Lunge your hands right in there. Diamond City. It's a clue, but not enough. It's something, which is more than you had a minute ago. Who does your partner know that lives in Diamond City? Because I'd say they're who you want to talk to next. Meow. I... what? 
Uh, whatever. Now, I got some errands to do. I'll see you later, maybe. Not here to perform some kind of revenge killing or something, are you? Cause that'd be a real drag. What are you talking about? You know, because I gave up Jake. Oh man, I didn't want to. But pain has a way of making a cat talk. So, you're not going to kill me? Don't worry, I can help. Tell me what happened. It... It was the Gunners, man. Burst in, demanding I'd tell them who I'd been selling info to. Asking all about communication devices and pre-war tech. I told them. I said I don't sell information on clients. But they weren't looking to buy. Ugh. Oh, bleeding all over my suit. Here, this will make you feel better. Oh, yeah. That feels much better. Thanks. Look, I didn't want to give them any info, but I've never been tortured before. I had no idea it could hurt so much. This... this cat couldn't hold out. I... I told them what they wanted to know. I told the gunners about Jake. And then they broke my legs as a thank you. Is... is Jake okay? He's not... mad at me, is he?
They took him. But I'm going to find him. The Gunners took Jake? Oh, not cool. Any idea where he might have gone? I can't help you there. I've no idea where they might have taken him. But wait. The tough that worked me over, I did overhear him mention a place. Um, an old schoolhouse. Malden Middle School. But there's nothing there. It's just an old ruin. Look, I don't like saying it. Jake was my pal too. But if the gunners took him, he's a goner. What do you mean? Gunners don't take prisoners. Whatever their reasons for napping Jake, chances are they've already put that hound dog down. Listen. Don't go kicking the Cazador nest. Don't give the gunners a reason to ice you, too. I don't care why they did it. They're gonna pay. Oh, man. I'm going to lose another client. <sighs> Fine. If you're going to go searching for Jake, the least I can do is try to keep you alive. Check the file cabinet in my office. There's a few stealth boys in there, behind a false panel. Take them. They're yours. If Jake is still alive somewhere, maybe they can help you get to him. And if you come across any gunners, give them a knuckle sandwich. Courtesy of... The Rod! Oh, yeah! <coughs> oh, I think a rib's poking at my lungs. I hope you can find Jake. Good luck, cool cat. Gunner snatched Jake. Yeah, that makes sense. What do you know about this situation? Gunners took Jake. You're off to get him back. Some will set shortly. Hope you don't mind. But after you left the hardware store, I sort of followed you. Glad that I did. Listen. First time we met, I didn't know what to make of you or your partner, but I had time to think it over. It's obvious now you're no friend of the Gunners. And for the most part, you seem to be able to take care of yourselves. Kidnappings notwithstanding. So I was thinking, maybe we should cooperate. You know, help each other out. Enemy of my enemy and all that. Let's just drop this guy and be done with it. I wonder if a bad attitude is standard with all ex-mercs. Really makes him stand out like a sore thumb. Why should I trust you? I'm not asking you to trust me. I'm just floating the idea of us working together. And why should I help you? Because I can help you. That information broker, he mentioned Malden Middle School. I happen to know there's a vault hidden under those ruins. One that's under gunner control. A hidden secret vault. 
Sure, seems like a good place for the gunners to hold a prisoner, don't you think? What's in this secret vault? Gunners, maybe some of their captives. Besides that, I have no idea. Why are you telling me this? What game are you playing? Don't be so fast to think I'm playing games. I'm offering useful information here. It's unusual for gunners to take prisoners. But we both heard that holotape. They wanted Jake alive. Now, I'm not saying I know for sure, but I suspect that if your partner's anywhere, it'll be in that vault. And it just so happens, I got the codes to get inside. So I say, we break into that vault, take down the gunner's station there, and maybe find your partner. What do you actually want? I'm not exactly trying to hide my motives here. If I can find a way to piss off the gunners, disrupt their operations, and help out potential allies, well, that's a good day for everyone. Apart from the gunners, of course. Which is just the way I like it. I don't know. This sounds dangerous. No shit. We'd be entering the Death Claws den. If you need to gather supplies or tune up your weapons, fine. But I wouldn't waste too much time. The gunners have your partner and I doubt it's for a friendly dinner party. Okay. Let's get to work. Good. I'll meet you near the school. Don't be long. Good, you're here. Done my best to lay low, but the longer we stay out here, the more likely we'll tip off the gunners that something's about to go down. So, you ready to do this? Anything to report? Only seen minimal gunner activity. I don't think they suspect anything. Once we get in, What's the plan? Work our way through the vault, see if we can find any signs of your partner. Ready. It's been a while since I operated as part of a team. Someone needs to act as the commanding officer, and I guess that's you.
So, how do you want to do this? What's your plan? Should we try and avoid killing anyone? That's up to you. Personally, I'd be happy to slaughter every gunner we come across. But if we give ourselves away too soon, cause too much chaos too quickly, we might just get ourselves killed. The plan? Kill everything in my way. That's the plan. Shoot on sight. Understood. Also, before we get going, you'll have to leave your cheer squad behind. I work better in a small team. I'll head for home, then. I'll head for home, Good then. Luck. Good luck. Let's move out. Follow your lead. Whoa there, hold it. You're in conscripts, right? You're late. Hey, you look familiar. You've been assigned here before? No, sir. First time here. That's right. I'm one of the new recruits. <laughs> Fresh from the plaza, huh? Captain West is digging your slot training movies. I'm Sergeant Wise, and you won't be reporting to me. So, unless you want to polish my boots, you're dismissed. So, what do you do here? I serve under Captain Algernon. He may technically be retired, but his word still holds a lot of sway. I operate as his eyes and ears out in the Commonwealth. But, uh, you should already know who I am. In fact, you should have greeted me by name and rank as soon as we spoke. Hmm. Tell me, recruit, which officer okayed your entry into the gunners? Um, well, all of them. Uh-huh. Nice try. But I'm not buying it. You're no new conscript. Wait. I recognize you. Yeah. I saw you in Diamond City. Oh, I see. It's all Someone falling into place now. You're the for that guy you captured. You must be his partner. The one he wouldn't shut up about. Well, sorry to disappoint. But you'll have to leave empty-handed. That guy stays here. Orders of Captain Algernon. Where is Jake? Whoa. You're scarier than Algernon. Look, I I'll tell you what you want to know, okay? Just lay off me. I'll answer some questions and let you pass about raising the alarm. But that's it. Rest of the security you'll have to deal with. So, what do you want to know? Is there any way to get past all the security? You'll need the right access cards to override the security locks. Check around the vault for the right cards. But don't expect the gunners down there to make the task simple. How did you find us? That hub device you had. It really did a number on our comms. Our leader, Wes, became determined to track it down and bring in whoever was responsible. But Captain Algernon had other ideas. He tasked me in order to find the device before Wes, bring it and its owner to him instead. We followed a lot of leads, but we finally struck gold with an information broker. He told us everything we needed to know. This device, where is it? I helped secure that computer thing, but Berman was tasked with transporting it. Sorry, but I've got no idea where it is now. I was busy moving your partner back here. Where is he? The guy we took? Lower levels. 
Captain Algernon has him in the old overseer's office. But it won't be easy to get down there. Algernon's got security and high alert. Movement's limited. A lot of doors locked. That's all I needed to know. All right, good. Now, if it's all the same to you, I'm out of here. You need to stop working for the enemy and come work with us. But come again? You want me to work for you? I won't pretend I'm not intrigued, but now's not really a good time. I tell you what, if you survive, whatever it is you plan to do here, then I'll contact you at some point, okay? Now, uh, was that all? I'd like to avoid any unnecessary violence. Hmm. I got an idea. Why don't you take the uniforms I was holding for... The new conscripts. You both already hold yourselves like soldiers. It's why I mistook you for the new recruits when you entered. If you were wearing uniforms, you'd blend right in. But you'd have to leave your weapons here. You're too heavily armed. It would raise suspicion. Here, these should fit you well enough. Thanks for your help. Oh, uh, you're welcome, I guess. I get the feeling things are about to take a left turn around here, so. I'm gonna take my leave while I still can. Best of luck. Hmm. Nice little setup. Security's a little lax, though. More mercs. Wise let you pass. Okay, good enough for me. Let me get the elevator for you. Hmm. Guess we won't be needing those passcodes. Move along. Captain Algernon's really been riding my ass lately. This is Captain Algernon. The base is to remain on semi-lockdown. All units stay on high alert. Movement between levels will be restricted until further notice. Whilst our guest is in our custody, these conditions will continue to remain in effect. That is all. Huh. Maybe he really is here. All right. Let's work our way down and look for signs of your partner along the way. Come with me. I need your help. Yo, psst. Hold.
Surprisingly well, so far. You know, I didn't actually think... Uh, never. Never mind. If you have something to say, I'm listening. When I suggested we come here to look for your partner, I didn't actually think he'd be here. I thought there was a chance, but what I'm trying to say is, I led you on, at least in part, but I see now that was unnecessary. There's more to this, isn't there? It's like this. I like to upset the gunners. I sabotage their supply lines, disrupt operations, and if the opportunity presents itself, kill as many as I can. But... It's been getting harder and harder. Somehow, they keep getting better equipped, better organized. When I overheard that broker, I saw an opportunity. You wanted to find your partner, and I wanted these gunners dead. I didn't lie to you. I just didn't really think Jake would be here. Anything else I should know? Back at the hardware store, I already had a pretty good idea who would take in Jake. I didn't know for sure, but I suspected. I didn't say anything, because I wanted to see if you could figure it out for yourself. I appreciate you telling me all of this. I know it's difficult. You're taking this a lot better than I thought you would. I've gotten used to working by myself, keeping things to myself. But, right. so now that we know he's here for sure, I fully intend to help you find Jake. And I'll worry about the gunners here later. Okay, that's enough fraternizing. Let's move out.
There we go. Sun will rise momentarily. something ahead that's enough what's going on here I gave permission to question him not to tie him up and beat him senseless I don't need your permission old man I got commands directly from Captain Wes last I checked he was the one leading the gunners now I'm gonna ask nicely one more time that computer thing we found in your store, what is it? Some kind of radio machine? Can we use it to boost our comms? That's not what it's designed to do. I didn't ask what it was designed to do. What the hell are you doing? You could have fucking killed me. I said enough. Wes may lead the gunners, but here, I'm in charge. And this is my prisoner. But Wes ordered me to- Don't talk to me about orders, Berman. You broke the chain of command, defied my orders. That comm computer was meant to be brought here with the prisoner. I was just- You're dismissed, Corporal. You can't talk to me like- Dismissed. Uh, you'll regret this, old man. I'm sorry about that, Evans. You hurt badly. Right. Let me see if I can find some medics or something. Slick! Oh, I'm not glad to see you. What? You know these people? They friends of yours? This is my partner. The one I told you about. And the other one is, well, someone I didn't expect to see again. Aiden McTavish, ex-Minute Man. How'd you get past security? What happened to the man stationed outside? Sun will rise momentarily. And you are? You'll address me as Algernon. Now, answer my question. It was them or us? Sorry, but your ranks are a little thinner now. Hey, uh, Algernon, right? Look, we never meant to interfere with the Gunners. This is all a big misunderstanding. There's no reason for this to escalate any further. So just... Just let me go, okay? We can all just walk away from this. I went to great lengths to bring you here. I can't let you go, nor your friends. Not until we've had the chance to speak. If you don't let him go, 
I'll kill you. I didn't bring your partner here to start a fight. Just listen to what I have to say. Please. The Gunners. We're under the command of a man named Wes. And currently, Wes has us contracted with some unnamed benefactor. By following the directions of this mysterious employer, we've become very powerful. But they've pushed us down some questionable avenues, forced us to compromise old traditions and values. What kind of compromises? Honor, integrity, leniency. Believe it or not, these were once values held highly by every gunner. We followed a strict code of ethics. But now, we're more concerned with expansion and control. If you need an example to where that's led us, you need only look to Quincy. Who is they? I don't know. Only Captain West has been privy to who they really are. But we've been working for them for many years. The gunners you see today are mostly a result of their influence. Please, go on. With our employer's backing, the gunners have become a force to be reckoned with. We've captured a lot of territory, extended our reach far. But there's always been a hard limit to how much we can actually hold and control. Because you lacked reliable communications. That's what held you back, isn't it? That's what this is all about. That's right. And now the gunners have their hands on the comm hub. I'm going to remove your restraints. Hold still. Ah. Nice to have some circulation in my hands again. Good, you're free. Now let's kill this gunner trash and get out of here. Wait, no, just hold on a minute. No. What do you mean, no? Slick, I need you to trust me here. Don't start a fight with this guy. Let's just listen to what he has to say. Please. All right, I'll hear him out. You're making the right call. So, Algernon, if you don't mind my asking, what exactly do the Gunners want with the comm hub? You already figured it out. Better communications. With something like your hub, the Gunners would be virtually unstoppable. But you're a Gunner too, right? Why would you want to stop that? Not all Gunners agree with the path we've taken. Some of us have tried to push back. But West refuses to listen. The best I've been able to do is slow him down. That's why they took you. Yeah, that makes sense. That's why you ordered your men to bring me in the comm up here. To slow West down. Right. But I was betrayed. Whilst Wise was bringing you here, Berman delivered the hub to West instead. What a scumbag. Guess things didn't exactly go as you planned. You have any idea where Berman might have taken the hub? Most likely to a hidden safe house, but I don't know which. All I do know is that it's only a matter of time before Wes learns how to use your hub. And once he does, the entire Commonwealth will be vulnerable to Gunner Conquest. I don't want to see that happen, so I'm going to help you find your hub and get it back. Why should I trust you? The last thing I want to see is a subjugated commonwealth, especially at the hands of the Gunners. If I could, I'd attempt to reform them. But current circumstances dictate a more direct course of action. I'll do what I have to, even if it means turning on Wes. I'm not sure if I want to work with you. I understand your reservations, but try to see the bigger picture. It makes sense for us to cooperate. 
You help me, and I'll help you. I'll reach out to those I trust within the Gunners. Some may know where Berman is hiding your hub. I'll need to act fast. West was already suspicious. After this, I doubt I'll hold my position for long. Wait, b before you go, how will we know when you find something out? As soon as I know anything, I'll be in contact. But in the meantime, you should return to Concord. I sent one of my people back there, a technician. Find her and give her these orders. She'll help you. I'm sorry we had to meet like this, but I hope you can understand why. You'll hear from me again soon. Well, gotta say, you sure are a sight for sore eyes. How'd you even find me? After I got grabbed, I figured... Well, never mind what I figured. Thanks for coming to get me. It means a lot. You mean a lot to me, too. Oh, I, I didn't quite mean like that, but, um, uh, thanks. <clears throat> All right. You. What are you even doing here? Decided to come blame me for even more things the Gunners have done? Well, since you brought it up, I guess you could be blamed for giving the comm hub to the Gunners. Give? They... they took it! What, why would you even... You are one aggravating little... Mm. If that guy hadn't stolen my gun, I'd... Easy there. Well, my work here is done. I'm gonna shadow our new friend. Call me crazy, but I'm not about to take the good Captain Algernon at his word. I'll check in with you once I have anything. See you two later. Whoa, whoa, wait a minute. Is that Aiden guy helping us now? I think so. I'm not sure. Well, this day just gets better and better, don't it? Come on, let's head back to the hardware store. Clear out any gunners still there. I'm gonna need a new weapon. Ah, this should be nicely. All right, let's get going. Intel file obtained. 